A quick disclosure, I earn a commission if you click the link in the description of this video and form your LLC with Busy. So, you're ready to start an LLC in Ohio, but don't know where to begin. I'm here to walk you through the entire process, covering the essential steps and other important information you need to know to set up your Ohio LLC. And guess what? It could be done in just a few minutes. Plus, I'll share some helpful tips to help you avoid common mistakes and unnecessary fees. So, do you want to know how to start an LLC in Ohio without the stress? Well, stick around because I'm about to show you the easiest way to protect your business and your peace of mind. Have you ever felt overwhelmed by the idea of starting a business? Well, you are not alone. Many aspiring entrepreneurs feel the same way. But here's the good news. Forming an LLC in Ohio is easier than you think, and it comes with some great benefits. First off, you get personal liability protection. This means your personal assets are safe from business debts. Plus, Ohio is super business friendly. Did you know that in 2022, over 179,000 new businesses started in Ohio? That's huge. And here's the best part. You can get professional help to make the whole process smooth and stress-free. It's what I call the peace of mind guarantee. By the end of this video, you'll see how easy it can be to start your own LLC. So let's get started. Crossing the threshold, choosing a name and appointing an agent. All right, let's dive into the first big steps you'll need to take. Trust me, these are crucial, but don't worry, I'm here to walk you through it all. First up, we need to talk about choosing a name for your LLC. This isn't just about picking something that sounds cool. There are actually some legal requirements you need to follow. In Ohio, your LLC name has to include the words limited liability company or an abbreviation like LLC. It's a small detail, but it's super important. But here's where it gets a bit tricky. Your name also needs to be different from other businesses already registered in Ohio. You don't want to accidentally step on someone else's toes, right? Plus, there are some words you can't use without special permission, like bank or trust. The state wants to make sure nobody's getting confused or misled. So, how do you make sure your awesome business name is available? Well, it's actually pretty simple. Ohio has this online business entity search tool you can use. Just type in the name you want and it'll tell you if it's already taken. And here's a pro tip. If you find the perfect name but aren't quite ready to file your LLC, you can actually reserve it for up to 180 days. It costs just $39, but it could be worth to lock in that perfect name. Now, let's talk about something that might sound a bit strange at first, appointing a statutory agent. Don't let the fancy name fool you. This is basically just a, a person or a company that accepts important legal documents for your business. It's like having a trusted friend who always checks your mail for you. So why is this so important? Well, imagine if someone tried to sue your business but couldn't find you to deliver the papers. That could lead to some serious problems. Your statutory agent makes sure you never miss important legal stuff like that. Now, here's the deal. Your statutory agent needs to have a physical address in Ohio and be available during regular business hours. You could be your own agent or you could ask a family member, but let me tell you why that might not be the best idea. Picture this, you're on vacation, enjoying some well-deserved time off, when suddenly an important legal document arrives for your business. If you are your own agent, you might miss it. That's why a lot of smart business owners use a professional service for this. It's not super expensive, usually between 50 and $200 a year, and some services even offer the first year free when you form your LLC through them. Now, using a professional service as your statutory agent is like having a security guard for your business. They're always on duty, making sure you don't miss anything important. Plus, it keeps your personal address off public records, which is great for privacy. Now, I know what you're probably thinking. This all sounds complicated, but here's the thing. It doesn't have to be. Remember that peace of mind guarantee I mentioned earlier? Well, this is where it really starts to pay off. When you use a professional service to help set up your LLC, they can handle all of this for you. They'll help you choose a great name, make sure it's available, and even act as your statutory agents. The supreme ordeal, 
filing articles of organization, and creating an operating agreement. Now, we're getting to the part that often makes people nervous, filing the articles of organization and creating an operating agreement. But don't worry, I'm going to break it down for you and show you how simple it can be. Let's start with the articles of organization. This is basically the birth certificate of your LLC. It's the document that officially brings your business into existence in the eyes of the state. Now, I know that sounds heavy, but it's not as complicated as you might think. Here's what you need to include in your articles of organization. Your LLC's name, the one we picked earlier, the name and address of your statutory agent, and the LLC's purpose. You will need to decide if your LLC will be member managed or manager managed. Now, don't worry if you're not sure about this last part, a professional service can help you figure out what's best for your situation. Now, you might be wondering, how do I actually file this thing? Well, you've got options. You can file online through the Ohio Secretary of State's website, or you can mail in a paper form. The filing fee is $99, whether you file online or by mail. But here's a pro tip. Online filing is usually faster and you're less likely to make mistakes. Now, once you've filed your articles of organization, you are officially an LLC. Congratulations. But we're not done yet. There's one more important document you should create, an operating agreement. Now, here's the thing about operating agreements in Ohio. They're not legally required, but trust me, you definitely want one. Why? Well, an operating agreement is like a rule book for your LLC. It outlines how your business will run, who is in charge of what, and how profits and losses will be shared. Even if you are the only member in your LLC, having an operating agreement is super important. It helps distinguish your business from a sole proprietorship and can protect you in case of legal issues. Plus, it shows that you're serious about your business. Now, your operating agreement should include things like how decisions will be made, how profits and losses will be distributed, what happens if a member wants to leave the LLC, and how new members can join. Now, I know what you're probably thinking. This sounds like a lot of legal stuff. How am I supposed to know what to include? And you're right, it can be tricky. That's where professional services come in handy. They can provide templates or even custom draft an operating agreement that's perfect for your specific business. Using a professional service for these steps is like having a GPS for your business journey. They know all the turns, all the shortcuts, and they can help you avoid the pitfalls that many new business owners fall into. They'll make sure that your articles of organization are filled out correctly and filed on time. They can help you create a comprehensive operating agreement that protects your interests. And the best part, you get to focus on what you do best, running and growing your business. Again, the peace of mind guarantee, when you use a professional service, you're not just saving time and hassle. You're ensuring that your LLC is set up correctly from day one. That means less stress for you and a solid foundation for your business. The road back obtaining an EIN and post formation steps. All right, guys, we are in the home stretch now. You've chosen your LLC name, appointed a statutory agent, filed your articles of organization and created an operating agreement. But we're not quite done yet. There are a few more crucial steps to take that'll really set your business up for success. Trust me, these final touches are what separate the pros from amateurs. Let's talk about something called an EIN. No, it's not some fancy business lingo. It stands for Employer Identification Number. Think of it as a social security number, but for your business. It's a unique nine digit number assigned by the IRS to identify your LLC for tax purposes. And let me tell you, it's super important. Now, you might be wondering, do I really need this? Well, in most cases, yes, you do. You will need an EIN to file your taxes, open a business bank account, and hire employees. It's like a key that unlocks a lot of doors for your business. Plus, it adds a layer of legitimacy when you're dealing with banks and other institutions. Now, here's the best part. Getting an EIN is totally free and super easy. You can do it online through the IRS website in just a few minutes. It's probably one of the quickest things you will do in setting up your business. And did I mention it's free? That's right, no hidden fees or charges. 
Once you've got your EIN, it's time to set up a business bank account. This is crucial, you guys. Keeping your personal and business finances separate isn't just good practice. It's essential for maintaining that liability protection we talked about earlier. Remember, one of the main reasons you're setting up an LLC is to protect your personal assets. Now, when you go to open your business bank account, the bank will typically ask for a few things. Your articles of organization, your EIN, and a copy of your operating agreements. See how everything we've done so far is coming together? It's like building blocks, each step supporting the next. Now, depending on what kind of business you're running, you might need to apply for some licenses or permits. This can vary a lot based on your industry and where you're located. Some businesses might need federal licenses, others just state or local ones. It's important to check with local authorities about any specific requirements for your type of business. Now, I know what you're probably thinking, this sounds like a lot to keep track of. And you're right, it can be quite overwhelming at first. But here's where using a professional service can really pay off. They can guide you through these final steps, making sure you don't miss anything important. They know all the ins and outs, all the little details that can trip up new business owners. Using a professional service is like having a personal business coach. It's all part of that peace of mind guarantee I mentioned earlier. And here's something else to keep in mind. Even after you've set up your LLC, there are ongoing requirements to stay compliant. Ohio doesn't require annual reports for LLCs, which is great, but you still need to keep your business information up to date and pay any required fees. Success awaits, your LLC is ready. So we've covered a lot of ground and now your Ohio LLC is ready to take off. Remember, using a professional service isn't just about convenience, it's about peace of mind. They handle all the paperwork and legal stuff so you can focus on growing your business. That's what I call the peace of mind guarantee. Think about it, an LLC protects your personal assets and gives you tax flexibility. Plus, Ohio's business-friendly environment is perfect for new entrepreneurs. Don't wait to start your business journey. Every day you delay is a day you're not building your dream. So, are you ready to start your Ohio LLC stress-free? Click the link below in the description of this video to get professional help from Busy. They'll guide you through the whole process, making sure everything's done right. Trust me, it's the easiest way to kick off your business journey with confidence. Don't wait, take action right now and set up your business for success. Good luck with your LLC and I'll catch you soon.